The following video uh, asks us to find the equation of a line AB uh, perpendicular to line AB, uh, and it asks us to do it through the point C. So the first thing we need to understand is what it means to be perpendicular lines. Well, that should always tell us. When you see the word perpendicular in reference to uh, analytic geometry like this, which is finding the equation of lines, um, you always need to remember perpendicular means negative reciprocal slopes. So we need to find the slope of AB and then take the negative reciprocal uh, to find the slope of our line that's going to go through C. Well, we do that by using the formula y1 minus y2 over x1 minus x2. And then once we find that slope, we're going to use the point C and the, the slope-intercept formula, which I wrote down for you, y equals mx plus b, to find the equation. So let's find the slope of AB and start. So we subtract our, um, subtract our y's, and so we're going to end up with negative 1 minus 1 over 7 minus 2, which is going to give us a negative 2 over 5. Uh, so our slope of AB is a negative 2 fifths. So to take the negative reciprocal, to find our slope for the line through point C, flip it over, and negative doesn't mean necessarily make it a negative, it means change the sign. So it goes from a positive to a, or negative to a positive. So the answer is positive 5 halves. So that's our slope. Now we forget about the slope of AB, we forget about a, point A and B, we now got our slope 5 halves, our point C, and we use our slope intercept. So the, the method is insert the slope, then insert the point, so we're going to put 1 in for y, 6 in for x, and then we're going to go about solving for b. 5 halves times 6 is what we're going to, the first calculation, or negative 6, I mean, is going to be, well, you can think of it as negative 6 over 1, which would give you negative 30 over 2. Well, negative 30 divided by 2 is negative 15. Um, and so we, need, we go ahead and go about simplifying that, so you're going to have 1 equals a negative 15 plus b, Add 15 to both sides, and you end up with b equals 16. So we have a slope of 5 halves. We have a y-intercept of 16, so we know the equation of our line. It's y equals 5 halves x plus 16. So the method, again, we used was find the slope of b, find the negative reciprocal to find the slope of our line, take the point c, and use the slope and the point in the slope-intercept form to find the equation of a line uh, by inserting it in and then inserting the slope and then the point and then solving for b.